I'm getting closer. I'm also getting sweaty. Woohoo! It is dumping up here. It's uh, fantastically beautiful. <laughs> and uh, now I'm feeling some pressure to make some photos this afternoon because uh, this kind of snowstorm is just fantastic. Uh, I think I, I just I want to find some wildlife out here. It's been a quiet day. And uh, uh, I just got to cross my fingers that I run into something up here that will want to have its photo taken today in this beautiful snowstorm. It's just lovely. Finally, the snowstorm is here, so cross your fingers for me, please. Holy crap, it's beautiful out. Where are the critters? Critter, 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 here, critter, 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 critter. Here, critter, 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 critter. It's too pretty to not be making photos. This is driving me nuts. here we go so it's snowing and it's gorgeous and earlier today I was out here and obviously there's these huge just sagebrush flats out here uh, and there were like 10 bull moose like I don't know how far a mile that way something a long ways away uh, I assume they're still there but it's kind of a whiteout out there so I can't see them but uh, I've got an hour left <laughs> of daylight, so I'm going to go that way and see if I can photograph moose in this snowstorm before I run out of light. It's kind of not a great plan, but uh, that's what I'm going to do anyway. So off we go that way. Hopefully I find some moose and hopefully there's enough light to make photos by the time I get there. Here we go. We got a long ways to go and a short time to get there. That what's that uh that was a TV show about that. Having a long oh my god, I have to cross a creek up here too. Shit, I have the wrong boots on, but I don't uh I don't want to waste any time changing my boots. Uh, all right. Well, I'll deal with that obstacle when I get there. Oof kind of deep snow deep heavy wet snow so this ain't gonna be easy going so I'm gonna put the vlogging camera away and start cruising bye bye I'm getting closer. I'm also getting sweaty. Uh, can you see them? They're still kind of just little black dots out there, but the snowstorm stopped. Oh well, since I'm here, I'm gonna go make some photos. And uh, hopefully I can get some good ones out here. Whew.
All right. I made it. The moose are here. I'm gonna still creep up a little closer here in a minute, but uh, the storm just fell apart on me. I mean, there's blue sky overhead now. So that's a bit of a stinker. Uh, so I think what I've got to work with here is basically, um, he's doing a Fleming response over there. There we go. Um, I'll shoot that little Fleming response. Can you see that on there? That's with his uh, nose up in the air, sniffing for ladies who might be in heat. Um, okay, I'm gonna get up there. It looks like there's at least three really nice big bull moose out here. So I'm gonna just go for like straight up portraiture here with just a kind of studio style with just a flat white background because that's all there is over there. Just gonna be straight up white background. So I'm gonna overexpose this to make that background like a third of a stop away from being completely white. And then I'm just gonna go creep up there a little slower and try and get some nice portraits of these guys. Uh, since we don't have snowfall or anything too um, too terribly interesting, just moose hanging out in the sagebrush. So that's my plan. I'll update you when we get up there a little closer and can start making images. <sighs> Well, there's just a whole lot of grazing going on out here. So whenever they lift their head, I only have a couple of seconds to make a quick photo and hopefully the background's nice and their pose is nice and everything. Uh, they're just busy eating. So anyway, this, the light's about to go away here. So I don't have too much time left with them. So, uh, I guess I'll, I'll sign off here. It was kind of a long day. I tried, tried, tried to find critters in the snowstorm. Um, and then I did find these guys and the snowstorm stopped and then it's getting dark. Uh, but uh, it was a great 30 minutes <laughs> with these moose. And uh, so I'm very thankful for that. And uh, now I'm going to head back to my car We'll see how far it is. I don't know. It's got to be, I don't know, maybe a mile, maybe a mile and a half, something like that. But it's hard trudging through, you know, a foot and a half of wet, wet snow. So 
I worked up a little sweat there, but it feels good. Get to spend some time alone with uh, these beautiful moose in this, this beautiful environment. So I hope you enjoyed seeing them. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.